what is up youtube welcome back to another video in today's video if you can see from back here right here does that does that look like anything different because that looks like a duck bill to me um so in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i mounted and screwed my duck bill in i was gonna record it when i was actually doing it but camera didn't want to my g7x everything my favorite camera my 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 everything back to the iphone so that's dead inside charging but i did want to make a video real quick before i leave away from my car because i have some stuff to do out of town so yeah let's get to it um first pop the trunk and then let me flip the camera so yeah if you look right here and in the middle and then right over here those were the holes that i had to drill this looked just like that um i just drilled through till this fit and then you have to drill this about half an inch bigger or so so that way your washer and screw fit in nice and the way that i was able to mount it and everything so flush with the trunk so what i did is i took and um, some old like pieces of cardboard kind of like a paper bag from the store you cut like two inch wide by like eight inch long strips and then you line them up with this hole you tape it onto here lightly tape it onto your duck bill line them up on the trunk so line your tape up and then you poke your holes through so that way your holes that are taped to your spoiler are poked out and you'll know exactly where your thing goes and then you'll close you'll lay your duck bill down right and then you're gonna take those strips of cardboard that are gonna lay like this they'll lay out like this out from your hole so you'll mark it on your hole and then it'll come down to like like two inches on each side and you're gonna like super tape that to your trunk and to your bumper so that way when you disconnect it from the duck bill it doesn't rip your template or anything and then you take your duck bill off and your pieces of cardboard should still be taped to your car and that hole right there is going to be your hole that is your center hole where you need to drill and you'll drill that through your trunk and then your wing should mount perfectly fine you'll just have to drill through here you'll have to drill through here and then you'll have to drill through here and you'll have to drill through this second sheet of metal on this one and on this one about a half inch bigger so that way you can fit your nuts in there nicely and then yeah that's pretty much it i don't have the weather stripping on mine so you can like see through it and stuff but i will be getting the weather stripping for it i just wanted to drill it in and make it look nice because i did take the stock one off so i didn't want there to be four holes for rain to get into and then i'm going to order up a plug kit from amazon to fill those holes and then should be perfectly fine it'll fill that hole and it'll fill that hole but I definitely do like the way the duck bill looks over the stock one. It definitely uh, makes it more sharp, makes it look better. But that's it for this video, and I do hope it helped you guys get your wing on because the videos that I watched definitely did help me with the templates and everything. Because when you order it, you're supposed to get a weather seal and templates that you tape to your car, but you kind of have to make your own so that way it fits. Plus, the car is a 2009, and it's for 2011 to 23. So it wasn't necessarily meant to fit my car either. So to be able to watch videos and have someone help you and guide you through it, I know it helps. And it definitely helps me build my car. So if I can make content and help you guys build your car, then I'm going to do it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.